Okay, here we are to talk about something different with Spencer's. And you know, the people are complaining that it's a place where there's a lot of inappropriate stuff that kids can come across and stuff like that. And I remember seeing a video. This person, I gotta say, they put a lot of effort into it. It was a school project, I think they said it was online. These kids from high school made a project about how it was it. And, and then they wrote this press release or whatever. And then they camped out in front of there and told people not to go inside or... They weren't like other people. They were they were respectful people and stuff. And they decided to... And what I mean by other people, I mean people that commit violence and stuff like that. Um, these people were really... Um, they were decent people and they just wanted to do a project. I don't think they really meant what they were saying, to tell you the truth. Because they never um, touched upon it again after that. They were... Um, they didn't want people going into Spencer's because it was inappropriate sex toys in the back of the, the, um, the establishment. People are gonna say, and all I'm gonna say is, is that you know, at least they put it in the very back, so people can know when they walk into the store not to bring their kids to the back of the store. There's a reason why they put it back there. There are disclaimers in front of the store. There's there's, there's disclaimers everywhere in that place to say what's in the store. So you can't blame Spencer's if someone walks in there like a six year old and sees the wrong thing. It's just not how it goes. Personally, I only buy lava lamps from them, and that's it. I bought a, my Space Jam blanket over here I've had for several years. Um, that's a nice blanket I bought from them, but I'll never buy from them again. Way too expensive. It's the, all the rest of their stuff is through the roof. The only reason why I buy lava lamps from them is because they're the only one you can really buy them from anywhere. Try going somewhere else. You find me another place I could actually go to the store and buy a lava lamp. I think once in a while, Walmart or Target might have one. But they're real shitty ones, so I don't want anything like that. Um, that's if this is the outside. Yeah, someone's doing something outside. There's always somebody doing some kind of crap. Um, what else do I have to say? Um, you know, when I saw the project, though, I just found it hilarious how all these kids really said, oh, it's not a good idea to go in there. It's, it's, you shouldn't do this. You shouldn't do that. I laughed my ass off when I saw that because I knew these kids weren't really doing it for the, because they actually believed in it. They found they could make a project out of it and that was it. Um, this was a long time ago. You date back to, I think, 2007. That's right. 2007 is when those, these kids did this video. And um, so you got to think everything was pretty primitive back then for, uh, for Spencer's. I, don't, I mean, not for Spencer's, for... Um, <laughs> For a, that's the scent. That, no, it's a dishwasher. <laughs> and you know, you see all these different things. And um, I just want people to know it's not a bad store to go into. There's a back of the store that has adult entertainment. There's no X-rated movies or anything. So if you're concerned about that, that doesn't exist there. There's just a lot of adult entertainment. The one thing I would love, what I would love, um. For these people to do is <clears throat> shit now everything's falling over <laughs> what I would love Spencer's to do is, is stop sending me the sex toys on my email newsletter like I got a newsletter because I bought from them so I know I can drop the mailing list but a lot of times that doesn't even work uh, what I would like for them to do is stop sending that shit to me it, it's really annoying it's how many times you're going to send it I mean, is that the only thing they sponsor for the whole store? Because uh, I've never seen anyone in all the times I've been in and out of that store ever buy any adult entertainment. They kind of go up to the stuff and kind of laugh. Because I guess if people want that stuff, they'll buy stuff off the internet that, and they'll spend a good amount of money on it. That, that more than what they're worth. I don't think they're going to buy it from Spencer's and embarrass themselves in front of everyone. Although people are proud of their sex life, so maybe they'll go out and do something um, drastic. Who knows? All right, well, um, that's that. Yeah, everything's winding down. All right, bye-bye.